Hello! In this video I will talk about nipple sensitivity, how it can change after a top surgery. I think many people have the question, how long will it take for me to get nipple sensitivity back or will I even have any nipple sensitivity after top surgery? That's why I want to answer this question with the information that I have and my own experience. I do have to say that the lighting in this video is very bad and I'm very aware of it but I just don't have any professional equipment to make it better so you'll have to deal with my kind of orangey looking face because of the yellow <laughs> lamp. If I don't put the lamp on then it's just all black so please bear with me. So. What I can say is that you should really prepare mentally to not have any nipple sensation anymore at least in the beginning after top surgery. After some time the nipple sensitivity can come back but in the beginning it just feels weird and numb for sure. In the beginning you will just have one area or multiple areas around the scars that feel numb. It's what we call dead spots, it's areas where you don't feel anything. So what I can say is that you should really prepare mentally to lose your nipple sensitivity. Prepare for it maybe never coming back. My surgeon told me this from the start, from my first consultation. He told me when you have the kind of top surgery that you have. So I had this top surgery, so it's the double incision top surgery. It's very common to lose nipple sensitivity. For me, it was never really a problem. I didn't even have that much nipple sensitivity before I had top surgery, so I couldn't even care less, really. After around three weeks, the nipple grafts should be healed and you can stop changing the dressings. So the changing of the patches. In the first month, the nerves will start connecting again. And this is important for the healing process. How can you feel this, that the nerves are connecting again. It's a very stingy feeling that you get. You can only know how it feels when you are going through it. I hope for you, if it's important to have nipple sensation, that it comes back. But please, if you consider top surgery, you should really prepare for not having any nipple sensation anymore. Normally, it takes about 6 to 12 months to regain nipple sensation. So if after 12 months you really have no nipple sensation, there's a big chance you will never have it. I would suggest talking with your surgeon, looking into the options that you have, because I did read that depending on which kind of top surgery you have, there's a bigger chance that you could have it back than another kind of top surgery. My kind of top surgery, the double incision one, has the biggest chance of not having nipple sensation anymore. But there's other kinds of top surgery. I think they are mostly for people who didn't have a big chest beforehand where there is no need for these big incisions and then it might be the case that you have a bigger chance to regain nipple sensation. You can also opt for no nipples anymore after top surgery. A legit uh, choice you can make. I've seen quite a few non-binary people online who did this and I even have a friend who did this. The pros of that are that way you just don't have to think anymore about nipples really. You don't have to go to that whole healing process then. Your nipples don't have to heal because you don't have any. Secondly, for example, some non-binary people, they don't want to look typically male or female and having no nipples is just like a whole different look and it can really be something that aligns with how you feel inside with your gender identity to have no nipples. If you do like the look of nipples on your chest but you just don't want the hassle of the healing process for you can opt for no nipples with the operation but then afterwards have a tattoo artist tattoo them on really. If you don't like nipples then you just don't do anything afterwards or you maybe cover it up with tattoos but not nipple tattoos just like of any drawing or design that you like to have a full chest of, of full tattoos. That's also a way of embracing who you are. I had about a C or a D cup, which is pretty big. I never really felt much in my nipples. I didn't really care about, about my nipples, so I didn't care about my nipple sensation after top surgery either. I don't even know really 
how to know if you have sensation. I don't feel much. I think I don't have any nipple sensation right now, but I also didn't have it before, so there's not a big change there. Make sure to make the right decision for you if nipple sensation is very important to you. I would recommend really talking with your surgeon about it to see what all your options are. Don't make a rushy decision. For me, this is all I wanted and I don't care if I feel anything there. So yeah, that's it and I hope, I hope this video helped you in some way. Make sure to subscribe if you liked the video. I will upload every, every other week on Thursdays. It will be about gender, sexuality and a lot about top surgery. So yeah, make sure to smash the subscribe button, give it a little like the video and share it around with someone who may find use in it. Bye! And yeah, be sure to check out my music as well if you haven't listened to it. It's on my other channel Imer, social media at Imer Music. Yeah, be sure to check it out. I would really like to hear your thoughts about my music as well. Okay, <laughs> enough rambling. Bye bye!